Hi friends, welcome to Just Home Samuel. Today we will be seeing Murukku South Indian Vissi Snack. Uh, for this I am using 2 cups of Idli Rice. This will be soaked for 2-3 to three hours. Normally we use this rice for Idli, Dosa and all. I am using the same rice for this snack item also. It's very easy to make. Okay, I am washing the rice for two times and uh, soaking it for two to three hours okay fine now we'll soak it for uh, two to three hours once it's soaked first let's grind chili and garlic today I'm using four red chilies and 15 cloves of garlic let it grind for some time then we will add soaked rice You can use it in, uh, you can grind it in mixi also. Today I am using the wet grinder. You can still use it in a mixer also. Okay. Add little water only. Let it should not be very runny. It should be a little thick. The consistency should be proper. So add little water as and when you need. You can use little water. Scrap the sides of the wet grinder. Even in the stones also it will struck as we are using little water. It will be tough uh, to run. So you have to use your uh, spatula to clean the corners. I am adding little water. Okay. Normally it takes 20 minutes to grind. If it is mixy, it will be faster. This wet grinder will take little time. It's very coarse now. It will take another 5 minutes. Okay. Okay. Now, after 5 minutes, we get the proper consistency. It's very soft. It should be in this consistency. Okay. Let's transfer it to a bowl now. Okay, for along with this, I am using half cup of roasted channa dal. I have powdered it and I am using it. Along with it, one tablespoon of butter. With this, I am using white sesame seeds. You can add black one also, but I am using white sesame. It's around two tablespoon. Then, carom seeds, we call it as omam in Tamil, so it's for good for digestion also as it's going to be fried in oil, it's good to have it. You can use hing also, but I'm not using it today. You can add the good salt, mix everything together. For two cups of uh, rice, one cup, sorry, half cup of roasted chana dal take half cup of roasted chana dal powder it and add it it will be proper along with salt carom seeds sesame seeds and uh, butter the oil is also ready in the pan so now transfer enough of this batter to the presser this is called the uh, muruku maker we just you will you can get it in all shops now Okay, now it's like we have to press it and press it to in a circular motion. It forms a circle sort of uh, design. Then you can transfer it to the boiling oil. It should be in medium high. The flame should be in medium high. Okay. It will be easy only if the consistency of the batter is proper. It will be easy for you to squeeze and get the proper shape. As I told you, if you need hing, you can use it. But I have used carom seeds. That's enough for uh, 
uh, you know the digestion and the flavor everything so i'm not using him today but the uh, spice is proper for this so for two cups of uh, rice use four if you want more spice add one more is enough don't use more than five it will be more spicy then okay put all the chakris like according to the size of your pan turn both the sides and once the uh, you know the oil uh, this thing sounds stops you can transfer it to our bowl with the pepper towel it's ready now it's very easy to make it's uh, it could be stored for 5 to 7 days if you like this recipe please like share and subscribe to just home samel thank you